Let's do this. Hi, I am Jeff. I am one third of Bonesaw Gaming. And um, I'm going to uh, be playing some Game Dev Tycoon. Uh, for the Best Adventurer Challenge, what the Best Adventurer Challenge is, is every time we stream, we are presented with a challenge. And by the time we stream next, my friend Adam, who is also part of Bonesaw Gaming, and myself both have to perform the challenge. And uh, we will get scored by the third part of Bonesaw Gaming, Jill, on how good our videos were, basically. And it's a, it's a competition. It's currently three to two in Adam's favor. I'm looking to even up the score right now. So without further ado, I'm going to play some Game Dev Tycoon. All right. Before I can start my adventure, I have to give my upcoming company a name. Let's do this. Bonesaw Studios. Screw it. It's a dude. There's no um, non-binary gender option. Which I'm pretty sure is what actually applies to Scroat, but uh, he's more dude-like, I guess. Let me get a hairstyle that is... Oh, definitely that. I don't even want to go through the rest of the options. Green, probably the best. Let's just go with that. Alright, Scroat. I believe in you. Yes, I would like to import all previously gained hints into this game. Let's do this. Let's make a game. All right, game one. Um, don't tell nobody about mana. Pick topic. Detective sports hospital rhythm. Um, I mean, I guess it was... A detective story at times. It's a detective RPG. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, I get. Sure. It's a detective RPG. Uh, oh, the G64 has 56% market share right now. But it costs 20k to develop for. Hmm. All right. Well, I'm just gonna. I'll do it for PC just to. Yeah, I don't have that much money, so we're gonna go ahead and develop for PC. Uh, not text-based. Screw that. Let's do this. Okay. So gameplay is important here. Engine, not so much. Story quests gotta be pretty important in an RPG, right? Um, dialogues, super important. And, uh, level design, artificial intelligence, not so much. Let's focus on the dialogues here. For don't tell nobody about mana. So many bugs. Oh my gosh. Yeah, let's go. This is Game Dev Tycoon, Wolfsbane. It's a pretty fun little uh, little simulator of starting a game dev company out of a garage. All right. 15 design and 9 technology. That's pretty good. <coughs> I don't have time to watch all these. Let's release the game. Let's see how it goes. Don't tell nobody about mana. Six. Could have been better. Screw you, Star Games. Oh, thank you, informed gamer. Detective and RPG is a great combination. 
Nice experience. Let's generate a game report about Don't Tell Nobody About Mana. Newcomer of the game has just released their first game. Don't Tell Nobody About Mana. Favorable reviews? Heck yeah, let's do this. Selling like hotcakes. 5,000 units in its first week. Everybody's telling everybody about Don't Tell Nobody About Mana. 32 whole fans. <laughs> we sold 5,200 copies and only got 32 fans. That does not bode well. <laughs> All right, all right. We're selling some pretty good, uh, our post-release analysis of Don't Tell Nobody About All right, Detective RPG is good. World design is very important. That's good. Yes, over 10K units. Dude, we're naturals. Let's, uh, um, I want, I want to make a game engine, but I don't have enough research points for it yet. So let's go develop a new game. All right. Uh, after Don't Tell Nobody About Mana, we played Mario Party, right? So we're going to go with um, Plumber Hootenanny. Which I guess is a rhythm action. Rhythm action game. Yes. We're going to release that on the PC. I, I picked action there. 2D graphics, obviously. Let's get some research points for real. Come on. There you go. Get some research points. I want to make a... Don't scratch your head. Write code. There. I don't know... I don't know if level design is really that important in Mario Party, but, you know, whatever. Need some good AI. Yeah, all that research. All right. Um, world design, not so important. Sound, pretty important. Graphics are probably equally important. Um, let's focus on sound a little bit. Don't tell nobody about mana is off the market. Nice. 16,000 total sales. That's not bad. All right. Come on. Just, let's pop some more. Oh, no, no more bugs. The Govador G64. The end of competing hardware manufacturers, huh? Well, now. I got plenty of money. Let's just let's just chill on this for a while. Let's make sure it, let's make sure it's right. I want to release the right game. All right, I'm bored. All right, so let's finish Plumber Hoot Nanny. A new record. Scroat. Getting some experience points. Scroat. I didn't get that many research points. I only got third. I only got 15 research points that time. Oh god, I'm, I'm nervous. <laughs> oh no. Oh okay. He likes it. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> informed gamer didn't like it, and he's informed. Oh, game hero loved it. Oh, what a weird spread there. Let's generate a game report. It costs 39000 to make. I'll probably make more than 39000 off of it. Oh, not, not as good of sales. Oh, no. Ninvento is planning to launch its very own home gaming console. <laughs> Ninvento is known for Dinky King. 
Oh man, Plumber Hoot Nanny is not exactly a hit right now. I need I need to do I need to develop a new game. Um We played Crystal Chronicles after that, right? Right. Um Last Dream Rock Stories. Pick a topic. It's uh sports. It had pig racing in it. Yeah, let's go with sports stimu sports simulation. Let's keep I'm going to sell out on the PC. We're doing this on the PC. All right, the engine has to be some like okay, so sports simula simula yeah, simulation. Engine is super key. What's All right, sales picked up for a little bit there. That wasn't bad. Still not even close to the success of Don't Tell Nobody About Mana. Dialogues. We're not going to spend any time on dialogues. Nobody's nobody's playing this game for the dialogue, okay? It's all about the AI. Oh, that did not work out very well. Oh well, it was still it still over doubled its investment. That's good. Stop scratching your head, scroat. The Ninvento TES. Cartridge based games and a uniquely designed controller, eh? Graphics, super important. Sound, let's go halfway. World design, no one cares. Fix those bugs. I kind of wanted a little more points here. Good work. Screw it. We'll do 12 and 12. I don't care. New record! Alright. Um. Hey, Lisa likes Twitch. How's it going? Let's release this game. Oh, man. I'm nervous. Last dream rock stories. Oh, oh, oh man. Give me that eight. Oh, you suck, Star Games. Sports and simulation is a great combination. Heck yes. Give me a nine. Give me a... Oh. The media darling, but, but will... Will it sell? I'm doing great, Lisa likes Twitch. I'm just doing a bit. Oh no. Oh no. It's not selling very well. Contracting business. We could use skills like yours. We have a short on cash. All right, cool. Thanks, Jason. Hey, all right. The second week was solid, though. The second week and the third week. And the third week was better than the second week. Okay, I'm not worried. Let's do some research. Let's make a custom game engine. We're getting fans out the wazoo. We have 282 fans now. 288 fans. Ninvento has released the TES. And we have a new game engine. All right. Well, I can make a new game engine. So let's make a new game engine. It's going to be, let's call it Red Rocket GE. We're going to get, we're going to pull out all the stops on our new game engine. Riding the success of Last Dream Rock Stories. 
We have a request to sell uh, to name the next game after Lisa likes Twitch. So I think I'm gonna do that as soon as I finish this game engine. Stop scratching your head! All right, all right, all right, all right. We've now completed the Red Rocket game engine. Yes, let's do a little bit more research. You gotta get a new topic. Time travel. <laughs> uh, yeah, sure, time travel. Let's research time travel. What could go wrong? Good work, Scroat. Now, let's develop a new game. All right, so we're naming we're naming this next game Lisa Likes Twitch. And it's going to be a time travel game. It's going to be a time travel adventure. <sighs> Not sold on the TES right now. That's Adventure games don't work very well on it. But I know time travel and adventure is probably probably a better combination. So let's let's make our first G64 game, and we're gonna use the Red Rocket game engine, 2D graphics version two, definitely. We've already got a bug. That's good. Story quest, maxing out the story quest. No one cares about gameplay. It's all about the story. Dialogue is probably important. Artificial intelligence, not so much in the adventure game, but let's bump up the level design. Oh, you know what? I didn't use any of the features of my engine. I'm an idiot. Oh, well. World design and graphics are equal. Uh, let's go down on graphics a little bit. World design. Yeah, let's go. Lisa likes Twitch, you better sell well, or else I'm going to be very disappointed in you. <laughs> Alright, screw it. Fix those bugs. Fix them. Give me another point here. Just throw one in there. Good. Design. Great. I need to sell this game now, because I need to make money. Oh, leveling up like crazy. Look at it. Look at it go. Yeah! Let's release this game. Game tutorials and mono sound. Okay. Oh man. Very enjoyable. Lisa likes Twitch. <laughs> Lisa likes Twitch is saying that she sells well because she's cheap. That's. You gotta work on that self esteem, Lisa. Yes! Straight eights! Four of a kind. That's a good omen, right? Another media darling. Let's do a game report for, for Lisa Likes Twitch. 74k to make, but... Oh, yeah, look at that. Selling 13.4k in the first week. Holy mackerel. Huge drop-off in the seventh. So, no, there's not that big of a drop-off in the second week. Oh man, making all kinds of money on Lisa Likes Twitch. Great, great. Tell you what, let's do some research. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> we'll make one more game and then I'll uh, call it quits. Making 213 point. Oh man, I got I'm rolling in the dough. All right, so let's um, let's create another engine because I like throwing away money. Mono sound. It's gonna cost me 120 thousand dollars to make this engine. Um, let's uh, let's call it. Uh, who 
who's ready, GE. All right, create the engine. Whew. 255,000 bucks in sales. Not bad, Lisa likes Twitch. Not bad. I'm actually about out of time, so I'm going to stop um I'm going to stop the vid the uh, the video I'm going to submit for the best adventure challenge, but um I might keep playing anyway. So, yeah, this has been the Bonesaw Gaming Best Adventure Challenge Create a Custom Character. Uh, I played Game Dev Tycoon, created Bonesaw Studios. Um, if you want to follow us on twitch.tv slash bonesaw gaming or you want to uh, follow us on Twitter at, at bonesaw gaming or Facebook at facebook.com slash bonesaw gaming, we are going to be playing on Monday, April 21st. We're going to be playing some GoldenEye, which should be fun. Um, if you would like to participate in the Best Adventurer Challenge this week, all you have to do is create a custom character in any game you want and uh, stream it or somehow otherwise capture it on video and host it on YouTube or some other video hosting service and uh, link it to us on either our Twitter or our Facebook pages and we will uh, share it and we will tell you what a great job you did. Um, and... Uh, Please tune in as often as possible because we have a good time doing this. And, uh, yeah, we would be delighted to have you. I'm going to make one more game, though. Um, let's see. What was the last one I made? The Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles? Okay, so we're at the Mario Kart now. So we're going to do Super Plumber Racing. Two racers. Sports. Action. Oh, I have to buy a license. That's rough. The Who's Ready GE. 2D graphics. Let's do this. Oh, I'm in the red? Okay, well, as long as we don't go into 50K in the, in the red. Oh, we're 39.3K in the red. Woo. Super duper. Alright, so that's not important. Gameplay is super important. Let's bump up the engine a little bit. Let's go, Scroat. We need you to step up your game here because we're about to go bankrupt. Level design is not important. Uh, artificial intelligence, pretty good. Dialogue is probably not. Yeah, good job, Scroat. Not a lot of bugs. Vina, another Japanese company. Sound, super important. Graphics, we're going to keep there. World design, let's just bump that down. No one cares about... Did I just not... God. I didn't use my new sound. Uh-oh. Well, I guess I have to. I have to follow my dream. No, 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 not a lot of bugs. Let's get another design point there. 18 design, 15 technology. This is happening. All right, whatever. I don't feel like watching all these bars fill up. Level up. Let's release this game. Uh-oh, give me that 10. I saw you flashing that 10. Give me that 10. Oh no, this was not as good as Lisa likes Twitch, according to the critics. Let's generate a game report anyway. Uh oh. Not selling as well as Lisa likes Twitch either. Oh, the second week was better though. Look at that second week. Strong second week sales. Really terrible third week sales. It's all even and out though. All right. The point is I'm not going bankrupt. Surprise hit with players. The developer Bonesaw Studios is fairly new to the gaming industry, but we cannot wait for what they will develop next. Nice. 
We have 875 fans, 898 fans rolling in the dough. We're the next big thing. You can't stop us. Put our hands up like the ceiling can't hold us. Oh man. Steady sales at the tail end here. Pretty good. 301,000 bucks in sales. Get some. All right, now I'm done. I'm going to save and uh Yeah. Thanks for watching. Again, follow us on Twitter at Bonesaw Gaming or Facebook.com slash Bonesaw Gaming. And until next time, Red Rocket. Yum.